All right, I already know I'm not gonna be able to make this the shorter, so we're just gonna, you know, do it like this. Um, and this is just like something that came to my mind. I felt like I should share it. Um, so we all know that like part of the gospel is Jesus died for our sins, and so the issue I have is like that's. Like, yeah, he died for our sins, but his work didn't finish there. And I feel like we don't really talk enough about how Jesus, he died for our sins, and then he kept working. Which is obviously something that we as humans can't do. Like, we die, and then, you know, that's that. Um, we go to be with the Lord, or... However, whatever happens after death. But Jesus kept working. Jesus defeated death. Jesus rose from the dead. And you know, of course, Jesus lived an entire life on earth. He came down from heaven. It's just like, because especially, especially where this is important is like when I think it's mainly Satanists that'll try to like undermine Jesus' sacrifice. Like, oh, well, he rose again on the third day. He just gave up a week. Like, no, he died a very brutal, painful death after living for. 30, 33 years. Like, you cannot say he gave up a weekend. He gave, <laughs> at minimum, he gave up the 33 years that he spent being a human, not being God the Son, you know? Like, he was God the Son, but he was human, and he did not have to, he didn't have to do that if he didn't want to, but he did because he loves us. And he died a brutal death because he loves us. And he defeated death. He kept working after he died because he loves us. So, do what you will with that. Um, like, subscribe, share, do all things. God bless you all.